Another high-ranking UAW official is facing charges relating to the ongoing federal corruption investigation into the UAW. Joe Ashton becomes the 13th and highest ranking person charged in the federal investigation. Ashton served as the UAW General Motors vice president from 2010 to 2014. He is facing wire fraud and money laundering charges in connection to a bribery and kickback scheme involving two other UAW associates. It's expected he's going to plead guilty, according to officials this afternoon. Four people facing charges tonight after an investigation into a string of ATM thefts that we've been reporting on throughout the area. The four were arrested in Ferndale yesterday by Canton police after attempting to break into a mobile gas station that was on Wood, that's on Woodward Heights and Hilton. Each individual now being charged with breaking and entering.